Hello viewers, welcome back to Person FNC YouTube channel. I am Divya Grover. In the last couple of years, the Indian stock market has demonstrated remarkable growth, exhibiting resilience and strength. This upward momentum has been largely driven by the outstanding performance of mid and small cap stocks, which have seen significant gains. At the same time, large cap indices have also made considerable progress, significantly contributing to the overall market rally. In the current calendar year, the broader Nifty 500 index has risen 23% after gaining 25.8% in the previous calendar year. The index is now trading at its all-time high level. With markets at all-time high, it is essential to exercise caution. Maintaining a well-balanced exposure across various market capitalizations remains a prudent strategy during such times. Flexicap funds with their versatile investment mandates are well positioned to identify opportunities across market caps. In this video, we will explore the highest return mutual funds in the last 10 years from the Flexicap fund category selected based on SIP returns. Highest return Flexicap fund in the last 10 years number 1 is Quant Flexicap fund. Quant Flexicap fund was originally launched as a thematic fund in September 2008. After its recategorization in 2018, the fund now follows an active investment strategy to identify high growth stocks and dynamically shifts the portfolio across large cap, mid cap and small cap companies. The fund has demonstrated remarkable growth over the past few years, consistently outperforming its benchmark as well as the peers and delivering substantial alpha for its investors. Quant Flexicap fund has demonstrated a notable preference for momentum driven stocks which sets it apart from its peers. This strategy often involves holding many of its stocks with a short term view resulting in a high portfolio turnover rate which has ranged between 300 and 400 percent over the past year. In the last 10 years, Quant Flexicap fund grew at an XIRR of 26.5 percent compared to a growth of 18.3 percent in its benchmark Nifty 500 TRI. A monthly SIP of Rs 10,000 over a 10 year period that is total investment of Rs 12 lakh in the fund would now be valued at Rs 49 lakh. The fund typically maintains a concentrated portfolio of around 25 to 40 stocks allowing it to capitalize on high growth opportunities and market rents effectively. As of August 2024, the fund held 28 stocks in its portfolio with the top 10 stocks accounting for around 48% of its assets. Quant Flexicap fund's top stock holdings comprise mainly large cap stocks along with a few mid cap and small cap stocks such as Reliance Industries, ITC, Samvardhana Mothers and International, Adani Power, LIC of India, Aurobindo Pharma and Swan Energy. Highest return Flexicap fund in the last 10 years number 2 is JM Flexicap fund. Launched in September 2008, JM Flexicap fund is a lesser known Flexicap fund that has turned out to be a category outperformer by delivering robust gains in recent years. The fund was earlier known as JM Multicap fund and it usually maintained a large cap dominated portfolio. However, after SEBI introduced the Flexicap fund category in 2020, the fund underwent recategorization. It now follows an agile strategy to identify opportunities across market caps which has helped it generate high alpha over the years. JM Flexicap fund's portfolio witnesses frequent changes and its portfolio turnover ratio in the last one year is around 100 to 150 percent. However, it maintains high convection in certain stocks and sectors to generate superior risk adjusted returns. In the last 10 years, JM Flexicap fund grew at an XIRR of 23.7 percent compared to a growth of 18.4% in its benchmark BAC 500 TRI. A monthly SIP of Rs 10,000 over a 10 year period in the fund would now be valued at Rs 42.1 lakh. With substantial increase in its corpus in the last couple of years, JM Flexicap fund now holds a fairly large portfolio of 60 to 65 stocks compared to 35 to 45 stocks earlier. As of August 2024, the fund held 66 stocks in its portfolio with the top 10 stocks accounting for about 27.5% of its assets. Its top holdings comprise many large cap stocks such as REC, LNT, Dr. Reddy's Laboratories, Infosys, NHDFC Bank, 
with a few small cap names such as CESC and KEC International. Notably, the fund has restricted allocation in each stock to under 5 percent. Highest written flexi cap fund in the last 10 years number 3 is Parag Parik flexi cap fund. Incepted in May 2013, Parag Parik flexi cap fund is currently the largest scheme in the flexi cap fund category known for its value centric and meticulous investment approach. The fund follows a buy and hold investment strategy to realize the full potential of each of its portfolio holdings. By focusing on value stocks with a significant margin of safety, Parag Parik Flexi Cap Fund effectively manages to keep the overall volatility low. This disciplined approach combined with its ability to pick quality stocks has enabled Parag Parik Flexi Cap Fund to deliver superior risk adjusted returns for its investors. Notably, the fund also offers geographical diversification to its investors by holding a substantial portion of its portfolio in select global giants. In the last 10 years, Parag Parik Flexi Cap Fund grew at an XIRR of 22%. A monthly SIP of Rs 10,000 over a 10 year period in the fund would now be valued at Rs 38.3 lakh. Among domestic equities, Parag Parik Flexi Cap Fund held top exposure in popular large cap names such as HDFC Bank, Power Grid Corporation of India, Bajaj Holdings and Investments, ITC, Coal India, ICICI Bank and Maruti Suzuki India among others. The top 10 stocks accounted for around 53.6% of its assets with many of these stocks being part of the fund's core portfolio for multiple years now. In terms of exposure to offshore companies, Facebook is currently the fund's largest exposure with allocation of about 3.3% of its corpus, closely followed by Alphabet Inc., Microsoft Corp and Amazon.com. Highest return flexi cap fund in the last 10 years number 4 is HTFC flexi cap fund. Launched in January 1995, HTFC flexi cap fund was formerly known as HDFC equity fund stands as one of the oldest schemes in the flexi cap fund category. HDFC flexi cap fund boasts an impressive long term performance history although it has occasionally experienced extended periods of underperformance. After witnessing muted growth between 2019 and 2020, HDFC flexi cap fund has suggested extraordinary performance in recent years which has significantly improved its long term returns. The fund now stands among the top quartile performers in the category across different time frames and has also generated noticeable alpha over the benchmark. HDFC Flexi Cap Fund follows a blend of growth and value styles of investing to generate optimal returns and avoids investing in momentum driven bets even if it results in short term underperformance. In the last 10 years, HDFC Flexi Cap Fund grew at an XIRR of 21%. A monthly SIP of Rs 10,000 over a 10 year period in the fund would now be valued at Rs 36.3 lakh. The fund usually holds around 40 to 45 stocks spread across market caps and sectors but with a large cap bias. As of August 2024, the fund held a compact portfolio of 45 stocks with the top 10 stocks accounting for about 56.2% of its assets. Popular large cap names such as ICICI Bank, HDFC Bank, Axis Bank, CIPLA and HCL Technologies currently form part of its top holdings. The fund has limited the exposure to individual stocks in the mid cap and small cap segments to under 2 percent to reduce the liquidity risk associated with small sized companies. Highest return flexi cap fund in the last 10 years number 5 is Franklin India flexi cap fund. Incepted way back in September 1994, Franklin India flexi cap fund has a history of about 3 decades to its credit during which it has been through various phases of hot performance and underperformance. After figuring in the list of underperformance for multiple years, the fund has registered remarkable growth in recent years, showcasing substantial growth compared to its benchmark and the category average. The recent odd performance has helped the fund improve its long term returns. Franklin India Flexi Cap Fund follows a blend of growth and value style of investing to pick stocks across the large cap, mid cap and small cap domain. It places a strong emphasis on effective risk management which helps it sail through volatile market conditions and downtrends. In the last 10 years, Franklin India Flexi Cap Fund grew at an XIRR of 19.9%.
a monthly SIP of rupees 10,000 over a 10-year period in the fund would now be valued at rupees 34.3 lakh. Frankly, in India, FlexiCap fund holds around 45 to 55 stocks in its portfolio. As of August 2024, the fund invested in 54 stocks with the top stocks accounting for 45.6% of its assets. It held major exposure to large cap index heavyweights such as ICICI Bank, HDFC Bank, Infosys, Bharti Airtel, NLNT, among others. It also takes tactical exposure in mid and small cap stocks, limiting exposure in individual stocks in the segment to 2% or less. It holds most of its stocks with a long term view to derive the full potential of each holdings. Investing in FlexiCap mutual funds is a great way to diversify your portfolio across the market caps and thereby maximize portfolio returns over the long run. The flexible investment mandate of FlexiCap funds allows fund managers the scope to generate high alpha, thereby rewarding investors with superior risk adjusted returns. Besides, compared to small cap funds and mid cap funds, which are very high risk, high return propositions, FlexiCap funds offer an acceptable risk reward balance potentially mitigating the downside risk better. However, given that there is no restriction when taking exposure to large caps, mid caps and small caps, flexicam funds are riskier than pure large cap funds. Having said that, historical data reveals that a majority of flexicap funds have predominantly maintained a large cap biased portfolio at most times. Thus, they can offer better stability during times of market turmoil compared to multi cap funds that invest at least 50% of their assets in stocks of mid and small sized companies. Investors should have an investment horizon of at least 5 to 7 years when investing in flexi cap funds. They can ideally prefer the SIP mode to invest regularly and benefit from the power of compounding of wealth over a period. Please note that this video is for information purpose and does not constitute any kind of investment advice or a recommendation to buy, hold or sell a fund. Returns mentioned herein are in no way a guarantee or promise of future returns. For more guidance on mutual fund investments, subscribe to Personal Finance YouTube channel. If you like this video, please give a thumbs up and share it with your friends and relatives. Signing off for now. Happy investing. Mutual fund investments are subject to market risk. Read all scheme related documents carefully. Registration granted by SEBI, membership of BASL and certification from NISM in no way guarantee performance of the intermediary or provide any assurance of returns to investors. Investment in securities market are subject to market risk. Read all the related documents carefully before investing.